So basically, guys, I felt like proper cheesy, like, like do my intro, you get me? So I thought I'd just be like, what I go on? And I'm back today with another banger. So, yeah, mad. Help me, someone fucking help me. Let's just say today started off on a mad one, guys, get me? First of all, though, yeah. Let me just say this, man set out to have a peaceful one today, I'm not gonna lie. I was meant to just chill with Benson, Arnie and Ice-T outside one stop, you get me, no long team. When a member of the West Side Massive tried to roll past man on my bike, bro, that's my R1 that is fun. Your brethren! Went missing a few weeks back, you get me. So despite the clear disadvantage of motor vehicle, a par took in the chase. Fucking break, break, break! Shortly after that, having to swap whip though, you get me? This my car now, fam. But I lost sight of a brother on this T-junction thing. Where the fuck's this motherfucker gone? Disappointed in my performance and dead set on retrieving my bike by the end of the day. I decided to fill the rest of my morning with extracurricular activities, you get me? Watch out, y'all, yeah, watch out! Bredrin. Bredrin. I just want... Boom, boom, clock! Boom, boom! It's the quick shortcut, you get me? Which way now, though? Which way? Before making my way back to the lockup to arrange a replacement whip for Wagwan in the last episode. Yeah. Oh, shit. No! No! Yeah, brethren, I need to borrow this one. Get out of this car, bro. Yo, is that Charlene? Charlene! So, I've arrived back at the lockup, yeah, and some stranger had the cheek to greet man as if to say this was his property. Hello. Are you dickhead, bruv? Di Are you mad, bruv? Shortly after that, meeting Santa Claus. Bumba Clark, Santa Claus! Are you mad? I didn't ask for no presents this year. Get off man's property! And having to remove man's sleigh from outside my property, you get me? Causing me obstructions and that. Turns out, his elves was across the road on standby if I'm just posting up. Come then! You mad? I continued my journey via stolen car. Bitch, get out the way! Watch out! And a quick airborne shortcut, you get me? After picking up my replacement, I took it out for a quick test drive. When the unusual weather conditions caught man off guard, Listen, yeah, bro. Listen. Listen to me. Are you mad? Hey. Who are you calling that? Don't talk to me like that. Continuing my drive. Continuing my drive. I eventually got back to the lockup. And had a little plan for how to get my bike back, you get me? Which would include a full Stormzy and a red old school whip. So I hit the roads, you get me? I ain't been up to shit, bro. I've just been chilling out here in the streets, you know, looking after the family and that. What, you still chilling with that dead team from back in the day, bro? Are you mad, bro? Talk about man's family like that. Yeah, I'll bring it back, bro. I'll bring it back. When some drunk female pulled out on me. Which I dealt with in the usual manner. Cut two. I hit Sports Direct. B14 out here, fam. B14. When some geezer, yeah, with a McDonald's hairline, stared at me on some dirty, dirty movement, bruv. You're right there, bruv. You're right there. Which caused me to launch a discreet operation. When two black males got in my way and blew my cover. Jab. Oh. Flat foot. Flat foot. Triple flat foot. You get me? And after clearing out all the witnesses. Will you stay down, bro? Shit. I returned to the store. One book up.
where I purchased my full Stormzy. What the f And after a quick rant in the mirror to hype myself. You mad? Are you mad, bruv? Listen, yeah. I want my motorbike back. You get me? I want my bike back. I want it back in one piece, bruv. Repairs, coverage, all them ting. Tire pressure and that, bruv. Full tank of gas, bruv. Are you mad? B8 to Therese. Batteries charged and that, fam. You get me? I took my stolen car to a childhood friend called Vince. What miracle did you want me to perform? Just a quick, just a quick paint job thing before heading to the ends to get my bike back. Oh yeah, by the way guys, I'm going in a full storms in a red whip, yeah. So that basically I can interrogate man and they don't know I'm big boy Samson out here because I'm wanted on these streets, man. I'm wanted. So as cover I'm going as the north side crips. I did a run by to see what I go on before launching my attack. Yo, RJ. Bruh, it's like that. When I saw a few strays in the alley, which I thought would be a good place to begin my interrogation out here, brethren. It's in my bike. Yo, never mind that. It's in my bike, lad. Hey? Respawning, yeah. I've come back for some solid answers, bro. It's in my bike. R1. When someone must have snitched on man car work got out here, cause like 10 to 45 man come around the corner as if to say this was some rescue mission, bro. I was like, rah, come then, come then, lads, let's do this. And for some reason, I made a habit of jumping out and moving vehicles. And after I got the bus back to the ends, everyone had left the scene. When I saw one geezer trying to flee the scene on one bike, it looked extremely similar to my bike. Get me? So I was like, yo, but weird. He's a mad. Rotted. Shit dick. Christ alive. Mad shit dick, bruv. Oh, you lucky. You lucky. Hey, watch my car, bruv. Long story short, yeah. I got cut off by a train. Eventually catching up with who I thought was a member of the West Side Massive. Turns out, it was an Asian male, bruv. And I couldn't let his death be for nothing, you get me? And I weren't going to prison for a petty thing like this. So I took his bike out for a little remembrance ride. Why? 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 When I pulled up to the strip club on a quick thing just to speak to one bouncer I had a disagreement with last Saturday. Yo, Bredrin, remember me? Last week. Yo, I come off book that. Are you mad? Well, let's just say I learnt my lesson. No guns in here, okay? You should have thought about that last week when y'all bust my head in, bruv. See that crack on the floor, fam? That's my head print. <laughs> Cut two, yeah. I tried to store this bike in my brethren's garage. Well, so I just come all this way, fam. You're not gonna let me in. You're not gonna let me in, fam. Fine, cool, cool. Driving home in a rage, I misjudged my turning. Shit, shit! Twos, twos. I ended up drapesing one white fella from his monster truck on a rage team. When some geezer took me for some dickhead, bro. Are you looking to get slashed up? The fuck are you talking to, bro? What is this? Nah, nah. What? Boom, book up. Thought you got away. Yeah, you were off. Thought you got away. What the fuck is going on in this neighborhood? This is madness. And to be honest. Let's just say, it didn't go well from there. My power, my pleasure, my pain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit. Shit, miscalculated. Miscalculate. Boom, book clock. Ah, right. And after pulling myself out of the river, I continue spreading the word of God. Get the fuck out of the car. Yeah, be still, be still, bro. Listen, listen. Yeah, listen, fam. Who's next? Who's next? You next. Get out. Madness. Madness. Bumbo clock. 
Man snatched the door. Off, oh, man snatched the door. Who the fuck shooting me? Boom, buck Till some house negro came and dumped it, man. Yo, Regin, listen, we'll chat it, we'll talk it out, we'll talk. Nah. Anyway, man was getting cold, so I called a cab, headed back to Smevit. Why are you staring at me like that before, fam? Don't make me use this, you know, fam. Where are you going? Hey! Uh, okay. To be fair, your man did ghost. Well, man's cab real quick. So I followed my legal right and commandeered his vehicle. Shit. Fucking always feds in the hood. And as per usual, I disposed of the evidence discreetly on the car park next to my house. Thank <laughs> you.